in our laboratory when we were researching these uh, sacred glacial waters where people lived a very long time, we found a certain mineral in the glacial water, a form of silica, which is um, basically an element used throughout the entire body to strengthen arteries and bones and, and skin, collagen and hair. Uh, silica is very important mineral in the body, but just like carbon or some other minerals, silica has different forms. Like carbon can be a diamond, it can be amorphous, like a, a fine powder with, with no sharp edges, or it can be what, what is known now as a buckyball, which is uh, a little tiny round sphere made out of carbon atoms. And they've discovered that buckyballs, for example, can hold ions in them and transport ions. And there are only a few places on Earth that have this kind of glacial water. For example, the Hunza people in northern Pakistan a high mountain valley, 8,000 feet high, surrounded by some of the tallest mountains in the world, receives their water from glaciers millions of years old. And that glacier water is full of hydrogen ions. We tested Hunza water, we've tested the water Lourdes in France, and it has hydrogen ions in it. We've tested uh, essentially what you would call healing waters from healing springs around the world, and found out that the, one, the healing springs with the greatest reputation that is where people have experienced miracles, all contain negatively charged hydrogen ions. And the result is that we believe that, that the H minus ion is one of the keys to the rejuvenation or, or the, uh, some of the miraculous properties associated with spas and, and mineral springs around the world that have healing powers or healing properties.